We've seen Real Madrid managing to get the job done this season, even when they weren't the best side. But before the break, they had that draw with Elche, then this tonight. Any concerns for you, Ali, from what you saw? There are concerns in the sense that this is the way that Real Madrid has been playing. It's, this is not like a big departure from what their performances have been like. They absorb a lot of pressure. They are defending a lot of the time. And you would think that it would be different when Real Madrid is on the field. But it hasn't been like that. A lot of the times this season, when they absorb in pressure and then they get out on transition, that's when they become truly dangerous. But they're not necessarily in control of matches. They're not necessarily carrying the pace of the game. This game was played in the manner that Athletic Club wanted to play, and it was physical, and we're going to pressure you, and we're going to force turnovers. And the goal does come from a turnover as Casemiro's trying to play out of the back. Mikel Vesca gets on the passing lane, then all of a sudden Berenguer is able to cut uh, Nacho to the inside and then finishes. The room for mistake, the margin for mistake right now for Real Madrid is very small. So when Benzema is not on the field, then that margin gets even smaller. There wasn't really, today, as you watch Real Madrid play, there wasn't a real threat going forward. It's not like whenever Real Madrid, even when they got out in transition, that you felt, uh-oh, here we go, all right, they're, they're going to get something going. No, they weren't creating opportunities. They weren't creating chances. They were not really dominating the game. So it's not a surprise that they lost because the performance itself didn't deserve more than that. What did you make of it, Shaka? For, for me, and, and Ali's absolutely right, uh, but as, you, as I looked at this game, as this game developed, it felt like a, a bigger game for Bilbao. Yeah. Like, they were the ones who were emotionally involved and that Real were just there because, well, we have to be. So when, when the goal did come in the end, it wasn't that much of a surprise because I thought Bilbao were deserving of it. I thought Bilbao took the game to, to Real Madrid and as much as... Real are happy to soak compression and hit on the breaker from time to time. And you've seen that. You've seen that kind of um, that, that, that approach from Real this season. All 90 minutes long, Real felt very um, one-tempoed. Like, this is how we're playing. We, we're not really going to change. We're not going to try what, to take control. What was control that, ter that term again? One-tempoed. OK. You just <laughs> made that up, right? I, I did. Right. I did. It's, a, it's a show for making terms up, that, and we're here well, for I, it, all right? He's very good at I, it. I, I've done that many a time. <laughs> I've, uh, that, this is just my latest. Thanks so much for watching ESPN on YouTube. And for more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for premium content and live streaming, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.